Alex Ayala is assured of a bronze medal after defeating Japan's Okamura Kyoka. Paolo Del Rosario gives us an update on that match and how the rest of Team Pilipinas is faring so far in the Asian Games. Hi, Pao. Hi, Denise. Uh, Alex Ayala mounts a monumental comeback to be assured of at least a bronze at the 19th Asian Games. It is the first medal since Cecil Mamiya topped a bronze in 2006 for tennis. Ayala fell behind early as she was swept in the first set 6-0 by Japanese foe Okamura Kyoka. During the interval, Iala was attended to by the medical staff, and according to Alex's coach, she had stomach problems in the lead-up to the match. But despite the troubles, Alex finally bounced back in the second frame, 7-5, before taking control in the third set with a dominant 6-0 sweep. Alex moves on to the semis, where she faces China's Zheng Qinquen, who is ranked 23rd in the world. Denise? What about updates on the rest of Team Philippines this morning, Pao? Well, Denise, apart from Alex, it has been a slow morning for Team Pilipinas. Marjolin Dedal finishes last in the skateboarding final and fails to defend her gold, while Gideon Padua forfeits the Wushu semifinals of the 60-kilogram division due to health reasons. But Arnel Sanda and Clemente Tabagur, Tubagara Jr. are both still set to improve on their bronze medals in their respective Wushu events. In gymnastics, Kirsten Lopez gears up to try to finish on the podium in the all-around final, while boxers Mark Ashley Pajardo and John Marvin looks to book their spots in the quarterfinals of their respected divisions later today. Denise? All right, thanks for that update. Again, that was Paolo Del Rosario reporting to us from China.